My name is Nikos Leonidas. I came to this country in 1959, the 7th of November. Where I live, around Dolly Seal Station, uh, it's about five minutes from the station to my house. I take Jubilee Line train, and it takes me, if if it's running smoothly, it takes me a quarter of an hour to come down here. But if it's not smoothly, because usually we get very bad, uh, very bad reception with the Jubilee Line. Sometimes they've got signal failures, and we stop and stop and stop and stop. It might be taking half an hour to go home. I must say, Oxford Street is a very noisy place. When I used to go to other places, it was nice and quiet. But they say Oxford Street is the heart of London, and the busiest place in London. But to me, really, it's very noisy. And sometimes it affects me even when I walk about, when I start walking to find my, my sport, where I am. When it's very noisy, it's very difficult because we blind people we always rely on our hearing as well. And this is what I'm trying to say that when it's very noisy street, sometimes it's very difficult to walk about. So you hear more vehicles than people. I wish you could hear more people than vehicles. But this is it, you see. There's nothing we could do. I learned to play the violin when I was in Cyprus at the age of nine years old. Now, when I came in this country, of course, I wasn't doing this violin business all the time. I did have a job from 1964 to 1980. 1980, I finished from work. In 1981, I started playing the violin, what I'm doing now, for 23 years. 46,000 hours playing the violin. Standing up playing the violin is very tiring, but I got used to. I feel more tired mentally than physically, to be honest with you. You know, I don't think I like what I'm doing. I don't like what I'm doing. I'm only doing it because there's no option. I tell you something, if, even me, I forgot to say that, if, if, if somebody came and offered me a, a different job to do, either play the violin on a hall, in a hall or find me another job as a telephone operator, I'd rather pack it up. Oh yeah, I had enough, because I tell you why, I don't see much interest on people. If you could come one day, just without telling me, and you stand there for, a f for half an hour to, to, and you find out what exactly, sorry, sorry, sorry. You find out exactly what I'm telling you. You see, people are not so much interested now. And when you are doing something and people are not interested, there's no point. Uh, it was a blind man who taught me how to play the violin. He showed me the figuring, what the first finger is, how to move the bow. Before where you play the violin. And after that, I picked it up with my own ear. First of all, he told me how to write the notes. But when I got to know the notes, I didn't bother anymore. It took me about a year or two to learn. And that's it. At the age of nine, I started playing the violin. Uh, uh, well, sometimes. Some people they might be come and say, oh, they might be saying you are, you are not blind, or <laughs> long time ago somebody come and start grabbing my boat, cut it off and break it. <laughs> but sometimes the police might be calm, not every often, you know. And they say, we have to move you, you know what I mean? What I do, I move. I go down, and the next time I come back again.
Well, in classical, I'm not very good. So I play Greek pop, pop, uh, pop flavor, you know what I mean? And English, if I know something. And Irish. Well, unfortunately, yet, I'm going to tell you something. I don't know what is interesting to you now. Yes. Oh, yes. Because, I mean, as you can see, this country now is full of foreign people. And this is why mostly I know foreign songs, but it doesn't seem to me people are interested anymore. I mean, I don't know, they might, become, they might, they might be interested when they buy tapes and big albums and it costs them 20, 25 pounds. Maybe they're interested in that. But when I'm playing, I don't see much interest anyhow. You see, when I'm playing the violin here, I want people to understand I'm not standing here playing the violin, shitting people, because all people are here themselves with it, the whispering that I'm not blind. You understand what I mean? I'm standing here because sometimes, uh, sometimes you can tell. Some people, people, they, they, they think that some, some blind people, they look, they are blind. But some people, they don't look that blind. You follow what I mean? You see, and sometimes when I'm standing here, maybe I'm thinking, maybe I'm laughing, maybe I'm thinking stories and it makes me laugh. And maybe people, they think, oh, you see, so you must be seeing something and it's my, you know what I mean? if people they, they, they don't bother to listen and they come and push up with kick it. I mean what was the point? <laughs> you know what I mean? You see? So uh, when, I, when I'm doing something I like people to to enjoy it. Not only for money wise. Not not for the people to come and give me money to say oh they're nice people. You know what I mean? But people in nowadays always rush, rush, rush. You know what I mean? And I don't like, I don't like this kind of uh, menace. <laughs>